Hello guys, welcome to Mr. Learning In this video, what about I talk to you for how to fix missing game files, game files required, installation the global shadow library are missing in Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth. Simply few methods. Before that, like and comment this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel. So go let's go ahead and one by one follow to this problem. Fix it. Okay, let's go ahead. First method. Uh, first method for the restart. Sometimes this method working now. So one time check it. Try it. Go to the start menu. Then power key press. Restart button will get to restart your system. Then go to the next step. Run yes admin. So that game. Then right click. Properties click here. Now cam ability mode. Selected the run this program as administrator. Cam ability mode. Below run this program as administrator. Hit the apply and OK button click here to close it. Again restart your system. Still running then go to the next step NVIDIA then search type that NVIDIA control panel then go to below find shadow cache size then expand unlimited selected Hit the apply, apply button click here to close it. After that go to the again restart your system then check it again. Still running then go to the next step, update the your graphics driver. So go to that your graphics, NVIDIA control panel. Go to check it. about you now it is closed go to the browser come to the browser here now type it the nvidia control panel nvidia control panel driver download button click here to update your latest version after that close it update the your latest version graphics then close it then on the restart your system then check it you are again that game then sometimes working now so go to the next step sometimes not working then only then go to the next step to revive the game files so steam double tap to open it then go to the library click here then go to the that game we okay, now selected that game Final Reaper 7 Reaper. Then go to the settings. Then properties click here. After that, open it. Open it. Then go to the installed files. Then verify the integrated game files. Click here to verify that game files. After that, close it. Close it. Then come to back. Then again go to the start menu. Then power key press. Restart button. Click here to restart your system. After that, your problem fix it. Thanks for watching and like and comment this video. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you have any queries, comment section. Go to comment. Anytime.